You like walking through my background, huh? Uh, I know. I didn't think you were bothered. Hello, everybody. This is awkward. What are you doing? <laughs> Hello everybody, today's live is going to be about makeup brushes and more, so let me add everyone, give me a second. Hey. Oh my gosh. Hey. I don't know if you can see me. Oh, let me see. I can't. <laughs> Hey, everybody in the background. Hey, this is my makeup artist, Dom. Hey. It's my assistant, Iris. Hey, sister. Assistant, assistant. Oh, hey, assistant. My bad, you probably can't hear me. I can hear you good. Okay. <laughs> How you doing? I'm good. How are you? Good. You see, I'm trying to... I can't read nobody nothing. I took my glasses off. I can't see nothing. I oh am my. <laughs> That's okay. That's why live is all about talking. Cool. <laughs> you ain't got to okay. see do that. We, do we got to get out? No, you can stay. Okay. So, everybody, welcome to my page. Um, this is my friend Tiffany. Hey, girl. We hey, are girl. we are doing makeup brushes, makeup, and yes. black women because I love black women. We are literally it. Okay, just want to let y'all know. So, oh. I, I'm gonna tell y'all how I met Tiffany. Um, I was just scrolling through Instagram, <laughs> and somebody tagged me in some makeup brushes, and I was like, "What is this?" <laughs> Why is this happening? I don't even wear makeup. What is somebody this idea? I wear makeup. I don't even wear makeup. I don't even know how to wear makeup, first of all. Girl. But I went to her page, y'all, and I seen these makeup brushes and they're they're vegan. They're high. I gotta hypo. send you some. I got um I got a care package for you that I'm about to ship out. So you gotta send me your address. I can give it to you. Oh, I'm gonna send it to you. And <laughs> They good. You see what I'm using? My own brush right here. What Look, I, I only be wearing, what is this called up here, you guys? You're going to have to ask her because let me tell you something. <laughs> I sell the brushes. I only wear what go up here <laughs> and I'll like. eyeshadow brushes. I, girl, there you go. Eyeshadow. I <laughs> only wear eyeshadow. <laughs> That's all I know how to wear. But girl. my sister and my sister in law, they like makeup fanatics. Bro, I don't know if I can see it, but I got my logo on my shirt. I can see it. Oh, geez, it's kind of huge. <laughs> <laughs> I'm excited to do Girl. this interview because I have a bunch of interviews coming up. And Ooh. so my interviews are simply black women. If I get some black men, you know I'm with that too. But right. simply black women. And basically everybody I'm interviewing is like a celebrity or some type of star and they wear makeup. And you know I'm promoting your brushes. A hundred percent. That's what. God bless you, girl. If God one of us you. make it, we all make it. We so. all. I not try to tell people that all the time, like instead of going against each other, why not come together? Yeah, uh, girl, you, look, you know, people on the I get good moves, I always hit you up, like girl. I know I ain't talked to you in a minute. I know like, it. That, that. Yeah. And look, long as we pray for each other and. Right. We share the good news, then it's fine. But some people take it to like another level. They don't want to share your good news. They you know what? Care. And they don't want to see you do good because they're not where they need to be. Uh huh. Which is what I'm trying to get back. Because I, you know, all my friends, I include them in everything that I'm doing. That's I go to works. everybody I know. Like I try to hire from within, not or network with them. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, because like, I'm. T that's how everybody climb that ladder. Because right. I tell them, when people get them corporate jobs, y'all think them corporate people got all them degrees and stuff? No, that's their right, cousins, nope. they uncles, they nephews. Right, well, they doing something else. No. Yeah, that I'm sure not about to do. You could miss <laughs> you me with me? all of that. I'm not with it. I'm not with it. So. I got school clothes all in here. Hold on, let me move it's on. It's okay, you good. You know we parents. <laughs> yes. I'm glad and you can't see my background. Wait, my husband is like walking back here, so I'm like looking off. He like dancing and stuff all in his background. <laughs> you might see a couple of things in my background. I hear a couple it's of things. Okay. So, so, be so good. what made you want to start the like the brushes being vegan and everything like that? I'm gonna tell you the god honest truth. I went to a store. I'm not gonna say the name. Okay. But me and my friend, which is actually her sister, my mm -hmm. sister's sister, we went to the store. We got. Um, we were trying to learn more about makeup. So Dom has been doing makeup mm -hmm. for a while, but it was kind of like, okay, I kind of want to know the basics. Let me go in the store and get the brushes. I went in the store and I tried to get some brushes. They couldn't really tell me much. Right. And not only did I spend over $300 for some brushes, when um, after I applied the makeup, my whole face broke out. 
I stayed at home for like a week. What? It was bumpy. Yeah, I broke out real bad. Like it puffed stuck. So mm-hmm. I'm just like, it's it can't, it gotta be. I thought it was the makeup products itself because I have sensitive skin. Right. So what I did was, uh, what are you doing? <laughs> <laughs> what are you doing? So what I did was like, you know what? Let me try another product or whatever. Use the same brushes. I cleaned them and everything. Mm-hmm. And then the brushes broke me out again. So I'm like, all right, it gotta be the brushes. Mm-hmm. So when I was putting the brushes on, and you said like, after a while, my face would start to tingle. Right. And I'm like, that's not how it's supposed to be. Makeup so, ain't supposed to have no feeling or nothing. Right. So I went to sleep. I promise you, I started this last year in October. I woke up and I called my boyfriend. I'm like, babe, like, this was a month before my birthday. Like, around this time, I'm trying uh-huh. to uh, make up and whatever, trying to look good for my birthday, trying to do it myself because Lord knows some of these makeup artists. And, you know, y'all good at what y'all do, but I don't have, like, $300 to pay for okay. you know? <laughs> So I'm like, let me try to get the basics now. So I hit her up, and I'm like, can you teach me? And then um, I told him, like, yo, those brushes broke my face out. Real shit. I mean, real stuff. I'm so sorry, y'all. No, you fine. You fine. fine. Okay, okay. So um, he was like, so what you want to do? I'm like, I want to come on with my own brushes. I'm tired. I'm not about to spend no more $300 unless it's going to be on myself. So right. what I did was hit her up, hit my homegirl India up, my homegirl Kristen up. Um, I forgot who else I hit up. And I kind of brought them together, and I talked about it. And I like, this is what I want to do. Like, because I know I'm not the only person out there with sensitive skin. No. And I know I'm not the only person out there who feel like they're spending hella money on brushes. And, like, the quality of the brush is horrible. Yes. So, like, you're, you're paying for the name for the stores instead of the Man. Brand. Right. So, with me, you're not even paying for my name. Nobody knows my name. You know, my right. brushes, though. So, you're paying for my brushes. And my brushes are hyperallergenic. Um, I did vegan because I'm actually trying to go vegan. Me too. I'm on the pescatarian diet, and I promise you, I've been like, I have my good days and my bad days. I've been you know trying myself. So. <sighs> I mean, what, okay, so, what is pescatarian? What is that? So it's just um seafood. Girl, I could, wait, can I have fried food though, or no? You you really have to do baked, but if it's fried, it has to continue to be seafood. You can't do anything other than seafood. Girl, I can eat fried fish all day. That's totally fine. See, with me. and I feel like because sometimes <laughs> you pass the store and you're like, that chicken smells so good right now. Right. <laughs> so like I'm, I was doing that, and I was like, eventually I want to go vegan. Mm-hmm. So I might as well start with my products because I know I'm gonna have a lot of vegan followers, and they're gonna want to make sure that I'm living the real life. You know what I'm saying? Right. So this my brush is an animal cruelty free. Uh-huh. No animals was harmed. Um, it's a hundred percent vegan, it's, and it's organic. So, I know a lot of people don't know that all these other big companies use goat hair, squirrel hairs, like animals. Shut up. Yeah, so you're paying, and then they get their stuff so cheap. Mm-hmm. So, like I said, you're paying for the name and not the um the product at all. Me, on the other hand, like my brushes are so soft because we end up baking them. Really? Make the bristles soft. Yeah, girl, I wish you could feel it. But these brushes are soft. Mm-hmm. Anybody I send my, you see? Anybody mm-hmm. I send my brushes to? Yeah. It's soft. Like, real soft. Like, and it that. lasts long. It doesn't shed. It's easy to clean and maintain. Um, and I really think people need to take better care of their skin. Why right. not start with the brushes that you're using? I don't think a lot of people are thinking like that. I don't think that they're thinking... Oh, I think it's the makeup. I think it's this. I don't think right. they're actually thinking it's the actual brush. No, they think they could just drink water and everything would be okay. And that's not nah. how it works. You got to nah. watch what you're putting on your skin. I'm very big on that. Like, I might put makeup on, but without my makeup, my skin is still flawless. I don't right. I do not do breakouts. So when I broke out that one time, because I didn't go through that phase in high school where everybody kind mm-hmm. of like broke out. I didn't go through that. Who was that? <laughs> I, um, hey, I baby. That phase last year. He's not going to say, hey, he probably shy. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't lock my babies in a room. They like, for real? Like four babies. They all in that room. Girl, my brother and my son. I don't know if you hear my son, but he in the background. Wow, he's he's saying, right hey. Now. Hey. Come on, just dance. We're going to keep it just like that. <laughs> I'm coming to the A, y'all. Because when it, I oh. see your clothes. Are you moving out here? I am trying. We lived out there before we lived in Dunwoody. Oh, and girl. That's not I, funny. In, I enjoyed that so much. And then, I don't know if we're looking for a house or an apartment. I don't know what we want to do because I like moving. So I, I would know. say to come. Like, I'm from Brooklyn. Moving mm-hmm. to Atlanta. I know a lot of people might complain, but, like, 
school wise and family wise and house wise you know what i'm saying like the apartments are reasonable out here right you just have to find a job will be self-employed that's the only thing once you have that flow of money coming in then I uh-huh and once because i'm used to like sharing an apartment paying mad blood for one of right and that's no it's county life right I'm ha- okay, we're gonna talk about that when we get off live. Yes, right? yes, I got you. I got you. I, I got, got a couple places. For you. <laughs> <laughs> but a lot of people, I'm gonna definitely start promoting it and put your link in my bio too because a lot of people are real life out here breaking out, yes. not taking care of themselves because they don't realize it's not the actual product. The product could be trash too, but right. they'll say, "Oh, it's because it's cheap." Is this? But it's really that brush you're using. People paying Kylie right like fifty dollars for some lip gloss this big. <laughs> Girl, I'm putting on my own lip gloss, too, y'all. My own vegan. My, my look, I told too. my mom about you before this. My mom is girl. completely vegan. And she was like, girl, does she make lipstick? I was like, I don't know. I'm going to find out. I have some. Yes, I do. I have my so look, She spoke that into existence for you already. Oh, so God look. bless her. <laughs> so if you go to my page, of course, my Instagram, I deleted all my pictures. I'm right. rebranding myself. So uh-huh. I want to say before the end of the night, you guys will see something different. I'm trying to, a lot of people... When you're not used to start up your own business, you kind of use your own personal page to promote your business. And I did that. Mm-hmm. And it kind of was like, I got to separate the two. Oh, you yeah. Know? So I am I have a whole bunch of pictures, a whole bunch of brushes. My website should be up no later than tomorrow. Okay. I'm the same. Always make sure you inbox me everything because I'm down for the I everything. I have another friend. We're trying to put something together around next year, around when everybody gets their income tax on. So nobody got no reason not to come. Not to come. <laughs> you know, I already told you. I'm coming through. You told me about it. I said, I'll be there. I want to put something together. And I want it to me, it's all about everybody being able to showcase their right. one thing or their two things, whatever they have. Without yeah. having to pay this big old price to get in and do this, because right. there's like an entrepreneur thing happening in Atlanta. Right. And I want to go, but I don't want to pay a hundred dollars to get in and then try to talk to somebody who's really not interested in it what is, I'm exactly. doing. Exactly. Like I could say a hundred dollars and pay for somebody to do a website or something. Like you I don't do that. People don't think like that though. You know what I'm saying? At all. Like so when you find a group of people who think like you think, right. and then. Gotta y'all got a force. You yeah. got Y'all got to stick together. I tell my husband all the time. He has the masters and the bachelors, and I got the mouth. And I'm like, you know what we could do with this stuff? Yeah. Like stuff like this. Like it together. Okay. It's crazy. Y'all like see how she's messing my hair, y'all? She's, I okay. I a love makeup her. artist and a hairstylist, y'all. Get at her makeup. Listen, with them. I'm yeah. coming. I'm coming to Atlanta. <laughs> you take care of natural hair. Yes, I sure do. That's okay. my favorite. Though. I love doing natural. Hair. Okay, so I got you, look, look, we all bragging. We look, all I got, I down. got three <laughs> girls and myself, and we all have thick, thick Negro hair. I love that. I love it. I like how you said so that. So we though. are coming. Yeah. And she will hook it up. She will hook it up. You guys make sure y'all follow her. Okay, like, so you can follow me too, but I don't have all my brushes on my page yet. Right. But I'm definitely gonna show it because I know a lot of people like Tiffany Cosmetics. Like, what do mm-hmm. you do? Yeah. One, I'm telling you, once the word starts getting out, like, it took a long time for me to get the understanding of, like, hashtags. And I right. would go to, like, different blogs, pages, see, what are you hashtagging? Or right. go to, like, if I'm trying to do makeup, go to a bunch of different makeup pages, see, what are you hashtagging? What are you doing? Because right. once you click that hashtag, oh, you automatically in that game. But you just got to remember to keep hashtagging it. Keep right. So once right. you get your, like, pictures and stuff, make sure you send them to me. And I'm definitely gonna tell my mama that you sell you got yeah. lipstick and tell stuff. Tell mommy I got her and I got her for this job. She just follows you. Look. Thank you, thank you. I'm gonna follow y'all back. Ma- okay. What Make you sure do? you let her know so she can send me an back. inbox with like everybody in the rooms um following and stuff so I can get everybody to see who's doing hair because I got a lot of people that live in Atlanta too that you know they want some of everything girl and i promise and I, atlanta is like everybody do hair down there so everybody want to charge yes. 500 dollars to do hair and i'd be like first of all i know how to work youtube okay so girl, I'm gonna my money <laughs> when it comes to hair and makeup the only person i call is her or shout out to forever doug he's great at what he do makeup by norman he's yes great at what okay he do too. Yes. Yes. okay yes they came yeah. to my event and everything they're so down to earth like i love i'm them. excited now yes. even more excited. We gotta move to Atlanta. Yo, and I have something major <laughs> planned <laughs> next year that I'm trying to do for all my makeup artists, all my beginners, people who want to get into the 
you know, the gist of it and everything. Uh -huh. I have something major coming up. I've been planning it for a while. I love so I'm her. definitely going to tell modeling you. for you. Like, she got this turned this shirt on, and she's just Yo, modeling the whole time. Man, I love my assistant, girl. I cannot <laughs> wait. Yo, she's crazy. We all funny. That I think. Ever. I think I'm going to have to inbox you or uh, text you. So I, I got some ideas in my head, too. Got like, you. Got this you. be dope. And for hair, for hair too, promoting hair, we doing all of that. <laughs> Yo. I'm glad that we crossed paths. I we am, too. A lot of people out there. I, I promise too. you, people are like, uh, can you promote this for me? People are like, oh, it's $400. No, nah, I'll pass. I'll pass. I never understood why you would want to rip somebody off who's trying to come up. Yeah, because all like, you're doing is showing people. Business. Right. And I'm so big on helping people. Like, it, this became natural to me. I'm like, no, I want to make sure my prices are reasonable because they're paying too much for nothing. I right. want you to stay in your price range. I don't want you to break your pockets. I know everybody got bills. Everybody got other things to do. You can shop with me and spend $100 and get a whole bunch of brushes. And it's, right. it's going to last you. Like, I have little to no shedding. And that is how me. you keep your clients. A lot of people right. don't understand that. When people go to the shade room or something like that, you're paying for that name once right. again. Right. Right. Nobody is no no. no. I'm gonna charge you sixty dollars for a straight fourteen days. Right. And I think that's fair. Like that's three times a day, and I don't ever take the post down. Big big websites they will take your post down because they don't want. They sure will. Yes, and they you're don't. Paying around twenty five hundred or more. I'm and like it's no. Like, I can't do that. There's a lot of celebrities, like a lot of people who were starting on the bottom like me and then mm -hmm. made it to the top and like they forgot where they came from. Right. So like they think because they have one million or a hundred thousand or whatever more followers they can charge you like buku prices. And I'm just right. like, I can't do that to my people. I Hell can't because I was once in this position. So when I make it, because I'm speaking to things, this is when I make it and we get to where we need to be. If anybody ever wanted to like, you know, network with me or whatever, I will always shout them out. Probably yeah. free of charge, or you know, I look out for you, look out for me. We can never yeah. some way we can make it work, but I don't want to take money from you. You know what I'm saying? Like you need invest into yourself. I'm so big on that. Spinky says, "So who we speaking on? We're just talking about people in general when yeah. they they overcharge you or they charge and they don't have to because yeah, I'm not talking about everybody, but like some people forget how it is to start off from the bottom. So when they get to where they need to be on social media, their first thing is, I'm going to charge you this amount of money so you can promote on my page. And it's like, right. at the end of the day, we got to look out for each other. You know and a lot of people they won't, they won't do that. But right. I'm feeling Tiffany, y'all. I'm telling y'all, on Instagram, off Instagram, I'm talking about we'll check on each other. And it has nothing, yes. to, do nothing with to do makeup with makeup at all or social media. Like, hey, how's the kids? How's everything? Yes. All right, cool. You know, if I was if we good. this girl. Yes, and people don't do that no more. No. And they wonder why people don't support people. Like people, that's why black people don't support black people. You're not finna sell me a slab of ribs for thirty dollars when I right. can four packs of ribs for thirty dollars. Oh we are crazy. our worst enemy, I swear. And I'm trying to break us out of it. I'm mm -hmm. also trying to do a cold drive next month once I figure out the details. Uh huh. I'm in, in Atlanta because it's getting cold, and I I have a weakness. I don't like seeing homeless people, but like right. <laughs> I'm going to sponsor it. My company's going to sponsor it. And I'm going to be out there handing out coats. You just let me know details. Yeah. Whenever I can make a move, I probably can't make everything because I ain't got no, like, steady babysitter. But whenever right. I can make a move. Girl, oh, oh, no. bring yeah, the kids. Room. Look, we bring the kids, right? Yeah, exactly. <laughs> I tell everybody that. My own girl brought her son. I said, we are family. Bring the baby. He's here, he's here, too. Yeah, bring the kids. We got to do you. Look, my son right there. Hey, oh, baby. Yeah. What time is it? Oh, yeah. You was talking, so I got it on my Okay. Well, everybody, uh, send me a picture, Tiffany. I got you. Your you. Brushes, uh, thank you. And I'm going to go ahead and post it and do everything else. But thank you for this interview. Thank you so much. It is going to be up on YouTube forever and on my page <laughs> forever. Bye. Bye, y'all. Have a nice one. Thank you. Bye, y'all. <laughs>